Hello my cheese and welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you are new here, welcome. My name is Nandi God, aka The Gods. I do hope you click the subscribe button and stay well. Long time no ho, huh? Long time no international ho. Hey, been a good one during lockdown. Yes, lockdown affected a lot of us, but I think really bad. Anyway guys, if you'd like to see what I got from Pretty Little Thing, please stay tuned. Two things under housekeeping, guys. Um, for hauls, guys, I won't be able to do a split screen because I want to speak through the clothes as I'm trying them on. Um, as much as you guys are here for the clothes, you guys are also here for my personality. So I give, I gotta give you guys everything and more. Number two, this video will be two parts, basically. There'll be two videos in one. The first part is basically giving you the logistical sides, side of how I got the stuff here. So I'll leave a timestamp for anyone who wants to skip over to um, the actual haul. Um, also, this is an academics channel, so I want to be fair. I don't want to leave any stone unturned. First part, guys, how I got the stuff here. A little before lockdown, sometime in March, I hopped onto Pretty Little Thing. Um, as you might know, might not know, I was planning an international getaway for my birthday. But unfortunately, that's not going to happen. But since I already had planned the money, I'm like, let me commit it to this so that whenever I'm able to travel, um, I'll have the stuff and not be finding, trying to find money. Like I said, guys, I don't focus on trends. I focus a lot on my personal style. And now that I've etched it out and I understand it, this stuff will basically last me for the next coming two to three to four years even. So I can still use them then. So okay, in March, I went into a pretty little thing. I ordered a couple of dresses. Um, unfortunately, post office was closed, so I had to make an alternative plan. They got lost in transit, but um, pretty little thing made me aware of this, and they refunded me my money. So I got the money back, and I hopped right back onto pretty little thing, and ordered this way. I ordered my stuff, then I downloaded football. Let me do it in chronological order. I ordered my stuff. I downloaded Global Aramex Global Shopper. It is an app. There's plenty of other videos that will go into detail, but I'm just going to give you a helicopter synopsis of um, what Aramex Global Shopper is. But I'll link those videos down below. Aramex Global Shopper is basically a forwarding address app. What you do is you get onto the app store and you download the app. You put in your details, then they will charge you. For me, it was 10 Rand, but apparently it's gone back to 150. Um, I paid through my PayPal account. Um, I paid the 10 Rand because it wasn't taking my debit card, something very strange, but I paid through my um, PayPal account and it was 10 Rand. So they gave me a list of addresses. This is literally addresses from China, Korea, England, I mean the UK, America, and so on and so forth. So because I was ordering from the UK, it's better to order. I mean to address it to your address in the UK. So basically you have a personalized post box where they give you like basically a name and a reference number. So whenever you input it in the site that you're using, um, you put your personalized um, reference number so that it goes directly to your post box and it doesn't get lost with other things coming into the warehouse, the Aramex warehouse, wherever it may be, America, England, China, etc., etc. So um, I placed an order because I've been coveting these pants and they kept going in and out of stock, especially in my size. So I'm like, I need to get these. These The pants were um, £10 and then the shipping was £3.99. Um, £3.99 pants. So that all together, that was £14. Then they sent it off to my Aramax address. Um, and then um, how long did it take? It took about about three days because I think I placed the order on Friday then Aramax told me it received it on the Monday then shortly after that I wanted to add on to my order um, I ordered two things one of the play suit was um, nine pounds and then the dress was six pounds um, all of these were on sale so I had to really gun for them and I had been wanting them um, and the other dress was part of my first order that got lost in transit so luckily it came back into stock um, and then I was able to cop it so that was 15 pounds plus my shipping which is four pounds they sent it off to the aramax they got it two days later so i, I emailed aramax and i asked them can they not consolidate my 
my order and just because it's coming to the same place and they're like no um they send out orders as they come so what they do at aramax they receive your parcel for you then they weigh it if it is below 0 0.5 i think it costs um i don't i'm not too sure guys but i'll put the amounts down below or the actual app link down below so you guys can look it up for yourselves but i paid 199 for my first order for them to ship it over to me in south africa from the uk in south africa then the second one also came up to i think 0 0.85 um which is under kg so i paid 199 for that as well so um my my entire shipping fee basically was 400 rand which i didn't mind because if it had come to the post office god i would not have gotten it number two um custom charges would have hit me so what aramex said they do if i have custom charges they pay customs for you because it has to go through customs um they pay customs for you then you pay aramex and then they release your parcel to you or deliver it to you so that's exactly what i did and i got my parcel i think my first order was placed on a certain day and then two weeks later my stuff was at, at with me um at my door and this was just peak this was level five i think level five or four um lockdown so i'm happy about that a lot of people have been asking me about boohoo as much as i gave detail saying that i delivered it to south africa i got it through my um, friend who received it for me in london and sent it to me i mean they came with it when they were coming home so if you aren't interested in shopping on boohoo maybe you should download the app and see your options and weigh your options if it's something you really want and you can't find in the country first point of departure look in the country if it's something that you can't find in the country go on and um use aramax global shopper also um if you want to shop in the u.s maybe american eagle whatever the case so that's aramax global shopper now on to part two of the video part two is obviously the haul and yeah 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 I have a pink unicorn bag and that is obviously from pretty little Sin. If I've left anything out, guys, in terms of Amarex Global Shopper, I'll link down the videos that I'm talking about down below, the ones that go into detail about it, because I thought it's just going to be a slip if I do a separate video, and Target Market Yam and Cost Shop, I either were interested, um, because you guys are literally here for the clothes, but you need to get the clothes, yeah. But anyway, um, goodies. Let me start off with whatever's on top. I got a beautiful satin dress. Let me turn down the light for you guys. I got a gorgeous satin dress, guys. I've been wanting this for the longest time. And I also knew that I'm not just going to wear it as a dress. I could always just double it up as a top. Just tuck it into some jeans or a pair of shorts and just dress it up and dye it out. Bang it. So it's just a satin dress. It's a mini dress. And um, it's ruched on the sides and it's got a mock mock neck and um, but obviously you see it on it's got a zipper long sleeved and then this is just a thing from this is the dress i got from six for six pounds and i got it in a size 24 and it fits perfectly because the last size left um that could possibly fit so i'm like i'm just gonna change the plunge and wear a girdle if i have to wear a girdle because it's very body con so i'm like Ugh, let me just take my chances i got nothing to lose so we have that even with this hair, are you guys seeing this? I look so opulent, upper echelon, guys. Like, this seems. I'll move back in a bit for you guys, but I just want to show you the top part. Here's the mock neck. Um, sleeves are long, but I just roll this up or bring it up always. Or people are like, oh, you like showing the tattoos? No, I just like rolling up my sleeves because it's more high fashion. The pretty little thing just puts this thing on for the bed beds and I'm going to return this. I look so expensive. You know, I Ma'am, you can't park there and my rebut is going to be, of course I can, I'm rich. Cause, are you seeing me? I've often not to move all the way back so you guys can see. It's obviously ruched and it's small, it's shorter at the back rather. Um, I saw this on the model, but I'm like, I don't care because I'm a body And then I have to short, sort out how I'm going to ruch it. And it seems bad. Look. Maybe back to the wall. I love it. Love it. 10 out of 10. Pretty little thing. Pretty little thing. Maybe one of those. 
Are you guys seeing me? Right, let me come closer. Are you guys actually seeing me? I can't even in the hole here. Wow. Then moving along, guys. Um. Then what we start this thing. Sorry. I got a pair of trousers now guys with all the effort that you put in in trying to get the stuff here and if you incur custom charges etc etc always if you're unsure of your size size up like I keep saying to you guys you can always make something smaller but you can't make something bigger so pretty little thing is notorious which I understand um, I'm making their trousers long um, but I'm always willing to I'm always willing have a tailor in your repertoire guys have a tailor in your repertoire or your entourage <laughs> or in your entourage um i got these pants guys i've been wanting these for the longest time these are even an old old stock i got pretty little thing because they were released um under collaboration with um little mix i don't even know who they are but um they got some backlash for appropriating the asian culture but get and call up on that guy that's never my intention but it's just these jacquard um trousers i got them in a size 26 and they were 10 pounds and I obviously got them tailored, guys. I wanted the crop top that comes with the set, but it kept being out of stock, and I just had to place my order because this thing was also going to go out of stock. Yeah, but so because the pants are long, guess what the gods did? I asked my tailor to take the remaining pieces and just make me a little crop top. So um, you'll see that better on. Absolutely love, 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 love this. Piece. and of course I can interchange it um, I can wear the top with shorts I can wear the bottoms with the white shirt because that's how I was going to wear it if I didn't get this um, pre piece of excess fab fabric this is just the mock crop top um, the pieces of the excess pieces from the bottom made something new guys this print is so expensive hope you guys are getting a theme top floor babe nothing or top floor that's handy. I move back now. The pants are so high waisted. Look and ta da! I really hope you guys can see this. As much as there's room in these pants, there's no give at all. Even sitting down, I have to sit at an angle. But sitting is temporary, trip is whatever. I absolutely love this guy. Where am I gonna wear it? I don't know, but I have to have I had to have it. Even a traditional wedding, I could wear these pants and then just wear a white shirt like I usually do. If I'm just going somewhere, wherever, running errands or whatever, not really running errands, but errands on the holiday that I'm going to go on eventually. I'll just wear this top with my denim cutoffs. <sighs> Pretty little thing. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, my G. And that's handy, guys. Like, wow, but I couldn't have sized down to a size 24 because uh, the thing is, wow, wow, then the last piece, guys, absolutely my five is this halter neck sequence um, jumpsuit. That I got for nine pounds. It was from 45. Also, the pants were from 45, but gay is still a pretty little thing. Are quite extreme, and I'm here for them, yeah. Well, um, looks like this. Um, I liked it because it's a good length, a short, it's not a very short short, so like a Thoriana, Thoriana thought. I mean shorts. Um, I got them in size 28, so obviously you guys can see it was too big for me. Um, because I was scared it's sequins and I'm gonna be a stretcher. Um, then my tailor did the things guys. It fits like a glove. Um, I look forward to my birthday vacay of birthday shingling whenever it may happen and I know stuff like this is not going to go out of fashion so that was my point of getting all of this. Of course there's not many ways I can get out of this in terms of whatever because for starters this sequence is very very delicate so even when I wear it I have to be very cognizant I don't catch onto anything because it's not pass a lot of sequence then it's going to be seen. Yeah well. Um, and then I can just wear it with flat sometimes and then sometimes I can wear it with um, high heels So at least I'll get my ways out of it and I just need to take care of it 
Whereas when my tailor was tailoring this for me, he's like, yo, this is so expensive. I'm like, really? He's like, yeah, it's very good quality and very good material. So let's see what that looks like. On. Literally so grateful to be part of the Itty Bitty Titty community. <gasps> look at how good my boobs look, guys. So this is just the top half. Um, it's a completely open back, but I don't have issues in my back. Kaji, only can lol. Closer to the time. Um, so I'll probably book a back scrub when they do. Probably obviously I watch my back, guys, but you know, then they'll just scrub it for me for that extra extra glow. Let me move back for you. Tada! I think everything is like tada. Top floor, baby. Top floor. My tailor is a genius, guys. Look at how well it fits me. I think I'm just gonna wear a shape of shorts just to it will smooth me out a bit, but. Comparison to what it was, he did an awesome, awesome job. Awesome job. Mark. Are you guys seeing? And it's just the perfect length of short and everything, man. I'm so happy with my purchases. Don't even want to lie. Don't even want to lie to you guys. For saying I'm buying face, I'm happy. If you guys watched my first pretty little thing haul, it was it was scenes. It was scenes. <laughs> There's no other word for me to put it. That is because I never understood my own body type, guys. Now that I've gone more I've gone make made more of an effort to understand it and my personal style, I realize that I don't look like the model. And you also might not look like the model. So don't don't be um disheartened by other videos I may, you might see. I think when I was able to pick stuff that suited my body and I'm, I'm very happy i'm very very happy there's nothing more i can say i'm very very happy um but i hope i was able to help you guys if there's anything that i might have left out please don't hesitate to hop into my dms i'm joking <laughs> into the comment section and i'll try my best to answer you um i didn't pay customs i think i left that out i didn't pay any customs because i think rumor has it if you order something that is less than 500, 500 and below you don't pay customs but that is a rumor because I have another order that came in and I had to pay customs so but we'll discuss it in that video um host below guys host below so subscribe share with your friends etc etc um anyway please don't forget to comment like share subscribe if you haven't and I'll see you in the next one